How y'all doing today, man? I don't know. I'm feeling good today. Hey, How y'all cool. doing? I got a lot of energy. What's up with it? I don't even know. I ain't even listening to no music today, but go uh go check out my song, uh Timing. Go check that out. Go check out the music video for this um genius. I'm doing a genius to the, for the music video. Watch out so y'all make sure y'all go check out that music video. What gave me the motivation to make this song was pretty much my loyals and my boy DJ Hood. Shout out to DJ Hood because like I said um, on Time Out, if without him, this this mixtape wouldn't even be out. It wouldn't be available. He gave me the idea to do this mixtape. So the entire this entire album was revolved around my loyals and stuff like that. Every track that's up on this album, I mean up on this mixtape, I should say. The album dropped December 22nd of my birthday. But every track up on this mixtape, um, the loyals picked the, the title name for it. I'm not sure who specifically, I, I can't go back and try and find it and everything, but I'm not sure who specifically was the reason for each song and stuff, but I can go back and try and figure that out for y'all for sure. But yeah, my loyals is the reason why this song was made. Good looking, babe. No problem, daddy. You gotta put my watches on. Baby girl gave me my watches. I forgot. <laughs> Watch out. I'm sitting in my car chilling window down with my fucking. Watch out. Stupid little nigga run across the road, got me yelling. Watch out. Keep on talking crazy, I'll lay you on the pavement. Put you on your ass, now I got you writing statements. That entire course right there was just pretty much me wanting to use watch out. I wanted to use watch out. Like, I got my watch out. Told that nigga watch out. You know what I'm saying? And I just jumped into running it and shit like that. Because I was, you know, doing a little choppy. Doing a little choppy flow and shit like that. But I had to get back to running the beat and shit like that. You know? Um, damn, I say shit like that a lot. Your family praying for you and that shit out. No, amen. Now that that one right there is a bar. I say your family praying for you in that shit out. No, amen. So y'all know whenever people pray, they they usually normally end out their prayers with uh, amen to end out their prayers and shit like that. And I say in that shit out. They praying for you, but I'ma end that shit out because it ain't no more praying because your ass gonna be gone, scraped off this fucking planet Earth. You know what I'm saying? So in that shit out. No, amen. Amen. You end out your prayers with amen. So I said in that shit out. No, amen. So I'ma end out their prayers. Fuck the bullshit. Your ass dead. Hey, man. Why can't you not see? I don't play, man. I got the best drive in the game. I ain't talking about no Lambo. At the beginning of that verse, I just played on A-Man. I just got done saying, in that shit out, no A-Man. And then I said, hey, man. So I just played on that. And then I said, I got the best drive in the game. I ain't talking about no Lambo. Y'all know when cars, Lambos, hey, that's low-key the best car. You know what I'm saying? And I said, best drive as in the Lambo and shit like that. And I said, I got the best drive. I got the best heart. Like, my spirit and my heart, my drive for this shit, I love it. I want it. So I'm going to go get it. My drive is unmatchable. My life a movie clip and I ain't talking about no Rambo. That one right there was just pretty much saying my life is a movie. I love it. Um, One day I'm going to make a movie about my life and shit like that. It may not be as eventful, but I guarantee motherfuckers going to watch it. I can guarantee you that. But, yeah, y'all and y'all know Rambo. He, Y'all know what Rambo is. Rambo. They begging for mercy like the Lambo. Shout out Bryson Tiller and shit like that. But yeah, man, Rambo is a movie. And I said my my life is a movie clip and I ain't talking about no Rambo. Busting at your bitch, never running out of ammo. That's just a little simple ass bar. Busting at your bitch, never running out of ammo. So pretty much, y'all know whenever they say busting, they talking about like shooting shots and shit like that. And then I'm sh shooting my shot. I'm busting at your bitch, never running out of ammo. Never running out because I'm going to continue to do it no matter what. Snapping and I'm taking life, bitch, call me Thanos. I'm pretty much saying I'm snapping. I'm snapping. I'm going fucking crazy. And then I said, I'm snapping and I'm taking life. Bitch, call me Thanos. So I'm taking niggas' lives and shit like that. And I said, snapping. Y'all get it? Because snapping. Thanos snaps and then everything is gone. That's what Thanos wanted to end up end off doing and shit. Like, end up doing in the movie Endgame. Damn, can I talk to them? Hell no, you can't talk right now. Shit, fuck. She keep on testing me and she gonna see how long I can go. I got a world-class lifestyle. Check my channel. Now that one right there, that was my favorite. I ain't gonna even lie, that was like low key one of my favorite parts off of this entire out off of this entire mixtape. I keep saying album, but um, that was one of my favorite parts because it was just so smooth, so smooth. And then I added in the no cap, and then I you know kind of chuckled at the end of it. Um, I said I got a world class lifestyle. Check my channel. Like you can look at my channel and see like I I got so much. I do so much on my YouTube channel. For the majority of it, you see a lot of reactions and stuff, but I got vlogs, pranks, skits. I got, you name it, I got gaming videos, and I have a, my own gaming channel. I have gaming videos on this channel. Like, it, I do so much, so I said I got a world-class lifestyle, check my channel, and then that's a bar within side of that entire thing. Got a world-class lifestyle, check my channel. If you go check my channel, what is the, na what is the name of my channel? 
world class lifestyle. Check my channel. And you niggas not even on my motherfucking level. Thinking that you better, better grab yourself a shovel. Dig into the dirt until you find yourself a devil. Now that one right there, I was just pretty much talking my shit heavy, you know? Dig into the dirt until you find yourself a devil. Y'all niggas ain't on my level. So dig down. Because you're not fucking with me. I'm up here. Y'all down there. Just dig down until you find the devil. And then that's just the thing. You you can fly as high in the sky as you want. You ain't finding God. You can find. You can dig down as much as you want. You ain't finding the devil. So I'm just going to have their ass digging for, for the longest. And then what I'm probably going to do is just take the, the dirt or whatever and toss it over the top of their ass. Just for being dumb. Because you think you're going to find the devil? Dumb ass nigga. That's crazy, because you look like a dumb nigga to do some shit like that. Yeah, I beat your fucking... Don't do that. I, I do look like the type to do something like that, but don't... Hey, no, I, the camera ain't it recording. It's recording. Chill. Bitch, I'm a rebel. Foot on a pedal, no bike, and I'm swinging on niggas. They thinking I'm Tyson. I said, bitch, I'm a rebel. And then I said, foot on a pedal, no bike, and so I'm I'm up out of here. My I'm, my foot gonna stay on the gas pedal. I ain't stopping for nobody. Foot on a pedal, no bike, and then, you know, bike. Whenever you riding a bike, your feet stay on the pedal. Because you have to continue to go. You ain't going nowhere if you ain't pedaling, my nigga. No cap. Unless you're going down a hill. GG's in the, in the chat for your ass. No cap. But real shit, though. I said I'm swinging on niggas. They thinking I'm Tyson. Y'all know Mike Tyson. He's swinging on niggas. And hey, shit. Nigga won't smoke. I'm up to swing on niggas. Damn, they're not your fucking head off. Don't lie. I'm dirtying you niggas like Tillin' or Bryson. Now, that one right there, it's a bar. I always thought about it. My mama was like, uh, go get the, go get the tiller. It's a thing called a tiller. I remember when we was working on my backyard and shit like that. Um, it's a tiller thing, and you can get it, turn it on, and it'll chop up the dirt. It'll chop up the dirt, and it's called a tiller. So I remember when she said, go get the tiller. I was like, what is that? And then she said, it's the it's the thing that got the little, it's, they like little pieces that look like these, and then they like chop up the dirt So because we were trying to get the dirt up, you know? And then she said, go get that. So I was like, oh, shit, I can make a bar with that. So I said, I'm dirtying you niggas like tiller, no bryson. Tiller, you put it in the dirt and chop that shit up. And I said, I'm dirty, you niggas like Tiller, no Bryson, and Bryson Tiller. When I get on tracks, I'm on top like the icing. I'm pretty much saying, like, whenever I get on a feature with anybody and shit like that, I'm on top. I'm going to be on top. I'm going to make sure that what I, whatever I'm doing on the track is top tier. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to be number I want whenever people listen to it, I want them to be like, damn. Quite show sure did have best verse, you know what I'm saying? Because coming from reacting and stuff like that, when it's whenever it's multiple people on the track, I be me and my homies, or just me in general, whenever I be reacting to shit, I'm like, hey, who you think had best verse? And I just say it to myself, like, who do I think had best verse? And I voice my opinion on that. So whenever people start to actually hear and listen to my music, I would want them to be like, oh shit, on that track, Quay, Quay never get dirty on tracks and shit, you know? And then also the bar with that one is. When I get on tracks, I'm on top like the icing. So think about it. Icing. What is icing? Icing on top of a cake and shit like that. It's on top of the cake. They respect how I do it because, bitch, I talk less. I look up to God and I thank him I'm blessed. And, bitch, I'm a challenge like I'm in the West. They fucked up leaving me open like I was Steph. So at the beginning of those lines and stuff like that, that was just me pretty much talking my shit. That's all. And then I said, and bitch, I'm a challenge like I'm in the West. Think about it. In the NBA, the West is the hardest conference. The East, it has gotten harder, but the West is still top tier. You know what I'm saying? It's just so hard to get into the playoffs whenever you're in the West. But whenever you're in the East, it's just like two teams fighting for that eighth seed. In the West, it'd be like four or five teams that's still fighting because all of the team, most of the teams in the West are good. And then I said, bitch, I'm a, oh, shit. And then I said, and they fucked up leaving me open like I was Steph. I know Steph and Curry. If you leave Steph open, you might as well want to just walk your dumb ass back down there on offense and get ready to be taking the ball in because he's hitting that shot. I'm growing and pushing my clout. You bitches ain't humble. I see it, no doubt. So when I don't help you, don't sit and just pout. Instead, clear the roads for a god bitch. Watch out. Bitches, watch out. At the end of there, I had to throw in the little watch, watch out. Just watch out. Get the fuck out of my way. But I ain't even lie. That's a personal shot. Like, I, look, well, if somebody see this, then you know what I'm talking about. So when I don't help you, don't sit and just pout. If I don't help you out, don't sit and just pout and get mad and shit like that. Instead, clear the roads. Get the, move the roads. Hey, open up the roads and shit for a God. Bitch, watch out. Bitch, just watch out. So I'm pretty much saying just clear out the roads. Let me come through. You know what I'm saying? All right. That was that was my last listen. That was a quick ass little song and shit like that. How how long was we recording? Um, how long? Y'all tell me. Look right here. Damn, 30 minutes? I talk too goddamn much. Fuck. Hey, hey, I already knew that, though. They be telling me that shit in the reactions. All right, bro. Hey, I've been fucking with y'all recently and shit. No okay. cap. I appreciate y'all and shit. All right, y'all, I'm about to get up out of here. Where baby girl at? She never here and shit. Hey, she's still off, man. She don't fuck with me no more. Hell yeah, no, she, she never she fucks don't. with you, brody.
I can't trust you though, bro. She that nigga probably, lying. She, she do fuck with you, bro. Shit. That's okay. I'm gonna get up out of here. I'm gonna be lame and shit. All right, peace out, y'all. Hey, I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all for tuning in and shit. Peace. I'm out of here.